Struggle, Decoloniality. In 1982, we started to work with Aina Schmidt. Now it's 40 years to be active in video, video installations and uh, performative interventions. In 2009, due uh, to the research into decolonial theory, and decolonial theory came from Latin America, based in the US, uh, theoreticians, uh, different positions, we decided to go much deeper into the relations between Euro Europocentrism, um, capitalism, hegemonic relations, and colonialism. Due to the decolonial theory, it was very clear that uh, uh, it's not possible just to talk about historical colonialism, that it is necessary to talk about coloniality, that is a present form of colonialism and is connected with the colonial matrix of power. This was a boost also to think how to make the video as a decolonial instrument, how to use video as a decolonial tool. And our first work was No War But Class War. This was a work done from 2009 and has the beginning with the decoloniality struggle as the motto of the whole video. In this video, we actually make a research. We show that coloniality is connected with the, uh, structures of power, exploitation, and it's based on um, very precise racist formats of knowledge, even more with the whole regime of whiteness that actually use racism and epistemology for new forms of coloniality. Then, in 2010, uh, I was invited by Walter Mignolo to come to Duke University for a workshop. The workshop was on freedom and it was on uh, possibilities uh, of thinking what decoloniality means in relation to coloniality. There was a theoretician, Kwame Nimako, Professor Nimako, was excellent uh, for the asking and actually making a parallel between Africa, European Union, and also former Eastern Europe and the European Union. What came out as just the final point of our discussion that was recorded was simple, that the whole idea of European Union is how to prevent Africans to come to Europe. And this was actually the whole period before the Ukraine war. These days we don't talk about this, but it's not uh, gone. And the third work was the work from 2011. They are the three most emblematic works, of course, we work on until today. And the third work is uh, Decoloniality, uh, Struggles, again, coming from that uh, just uh, idea from 2009. It was recorded in Bogota, in Colombia, and it was connected with uh, um, a series of lectures uh, organized by the university in Bogota and also under the invitation of Walter Mignolo there, with uh, names like uh, Nadia Granados uh, and uh, other researchers uh, that were coming from Bolivia, Ecuador, uh, Colombia, US, and so on, it was possible to reflect what decoloniality means. Actually, I start uh, this video with a lecture in a public space, in a public university, where I greet all those sitting there with good morning, decolonialist, and I ask, who remember colonialism? This was a test also, how somebody from Europe can talk in Latin America about these questions. And at that point, it was clear that the politics of decoloniality is the only possible politics for the future of video.